Hey guys, Mason here and welcome back to another video. So in this video, we are going to be checking out the brand new Halloween event on Weapon Fighting Simulator. Let's get right into this. So this event is a lot different from the previous events. It is actually somewhat similar to the Easter event that they had, which that event was like the biggest event they had. So, so let's go ahead and check out this new one though. So this is so much better than the, just one of those basic events they have. So yeah, so th for this one, what you want to go ahead and do, teleport to the material world, and this is where you will find the main area. So in this main area, a pumpkin cart will spawn every half an hour right here. So, so you can go ahead and run around the pumpkin cart, I believe, to go ahead and earn candy. So, so you can go ahead and find, about the can find out about the candy stuff by clicking this up here, daily cap, and then it will tell you all this stuff. Which actually for the jack-o'-lantern one, I think that is this dude right here. So, so we can actually go ahead and chase him, and I think he will give us candy. And there we go, yep, we just got 8 candy for chasing him, and quite a bit of spear stones as well. So that's pretty nice. So, so we got 8 candy from that. And for this, I believe, well actually I don't know how much candy you can get from this, but this right here, you can get 5 candies a day from the material world. So I think can candies just randomly spawn around here. That is pretty cool. And for this, they actually have special Halloween weapons. So yeah, these right over here. And alright, definitely gotta go ahead and hatch some of these later on. Like this exotic right there. So there's only legendaries, mythics, eternals, and exotics. So that's pretty cool. And then over here, Halloween quest. And okay, so th yeah, that one isn't in here now. It's actually its very own thing. And alright, they actually added another exclusive weapon. If y'all don't know... A few months ago, they added an exclusive weapon into the game that you could only get for like a week. And then they haven't added an exclusive weapon since. So, so definitely need to go ahead and get this right here. So get five witch witchkin. I don't really know what that is. Get one shine plus plus witchkin. Okay. Still don't know what that is. Witchkin and witchkin. Alright, so maybe, maybe that's a weapon from over here. Well, now we actually have enough of the candies. We just got 10 of them randomly. Don't really know how. So, so let's go ahead and open one of these up. And alright, so this is a pump... Pumpter, I think it said. And alright, it doesn't do the most amount of damage ever, but it's a decent. And actually, 5 to 1. And nah, it's actually pretty bad. Oh wait, never mind. It's actually not that bad. Because these ones right here... These do only 300 trillion damage. So it's actually not that bad. That means the exotic in here is probably going to be pretty good. Oh, and these ones are not affected by luck, it says on the bottom. So if you use like any lucky boost, this will not affect it. So that kind of stinks. But I guess it's alright. Well, actually, let's go ahead and take a look. Yeah, never mind. That's alright because you have an 8% chance to hatch that. That is actually really high for an exotic. So it's a pretty cool. What is a witchkin though? Alright, I just went ahead and asked what a witchkin is, and apparently it's one of these weapons. And I'm assuming it's the exotic one right there. So yeah, so we are in the test server by the way. Forgot to mention that, but we are in the test server. By the way, these things right here, they might change. Not sure, because we are in the test server. And the update releases in about like probably 3 or so hours. So, so let's go ahead and get some of those. And now let's go ahead and open some of these and see if we can go ahead and get an exotic. So there we go, nothing good. And let's go ahead and keep checking. Alright, we did get an eternal right there, so that's pretty nice. We have an 8% chance to get this. So that means basically every 3 times we open these, we are pretty likely to get one. And there we go, we just got one. And okay, that does a lot of damage. I don't know if it's just because of like how high of a level it is. But that right there, that does a lot of damage. So, so these in the regular game are going to be really awesome. So, so let's go ahead and keep opening these. And then let's go ahead and get quite a bit of them. So let's go ahead and see, look at the thing again. So we need to get five of them. And then we need to make a shiny plus plus one. Then we, ne then we need to make two shiny plus plus, And then three shiny plus plus. Alright, so that's probably why they're pretty easy to get and they're only an 8%. Because you have to make 3 shiny plus plus witchkins to go ahead and get all of these. So, so that is pretty nice. 
and then we can go ahead and unlock one of those. Alright, well, I'm going to go ahead and auto-open these eggs now, and I'll be back whenever we can go ahead and make three shiny plus plus witchkins. Alright, I went ahead and got tons of these witchkins right here. So, it actually didn't take as long as I thought it would to go ahead and get all these. Like, I have all of these right here. Let me go ahead and reopen that. All of these? I think this is enough. I do have some Eternals. I did have a lot more Eternals, but I went ahead and deleted some. But yeah, now looking at them right now, not sure if I have enough. But all I need is three, so I think I do. So let's go ahead and head over to the shiny blacksmith. And yeah, of course, these don't need spars. All they need is some um, QI because these are Halloween event items. So, yeah, so there's no way they would need spars. So yeah, so let's go ahead and fuse all of these together. And then we'll go ahead and make them shiny plus plus. Oh, never mind. I'm used to making shiny plus items. But I forgot, these have to be shiny plus plus. So that means they're going to take a lot more than I thought they would. But yeah, usually in videos I just make shiny plus items. I like usually never make shiny plus plus. So, yeah, so this is actually going to be pretty hard. But the event does last 14 days. So anyone who's playing in like the actual game should maybe be able to do this. But yeah, I think this is only going to be enough for like one and a half shiny plus plus items then. So, so let's go ahead and keep doing this. I'll probably go ahead and delete some of the Eternals. And then go ahead and keep doing this again. But yeah, so here we go. Yep, we only have enough for one. Wow, alright, that is pretty expensive. So, so all I need is two more though. So we'll go ahead and do uh, that real quick. But before we go ahead and do that, let's go ahead and take a look at the quest. Oh yeah, and here is the thing right here. Just went ahead and spawned in. It's at 100% right now. Don't know what that means. And yeah, don't really know what 100% means. So let's go ahead and make sure we equip best. I actually thought this would be a lot bigger. Oh, jump around the pumpkin cart to trick or treat. Oh, so every time we jump, it goes down. Alright, that's pretty cool. So here we go. So I think this spawns candy. Trick or treat and get candies. Alright. And, alright. So we have 988 right now. I'm not sure if it spawns them in or if it just gives it to us. Or maybe this has to like go all the way to zero first. Alright, here we go. It's almost broken. So let's go ahead and see if this drops any candies. And there we go. And yep, there we go. Went ahead and dropped some. And it dropped quite a bit. Collect all of these right here. And alright, nah. So each one of these gives us two, I think. Let's go ahead and look at that again. So yeah, so each one of these candies gives us two candies. So that's pretty nice. And oh, so it actually went back up in health. So I can actually go ahead and spawn more of those. That's pretty nice. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and open up more eggs. And I'll be back whenever we have enough to go ahead and make two more shiny plus plus witchkins. Alright, we finally got enough to go ahead and make two more shiny plus plus. I already went ahead and made all of them shiny plus. So let's go ahead and make them shiny plus plus right now. So here we go. Toss this one in. That is one more shiny plus plus. And then here we go. Last one right there. Alright, awesome. Let's go ahead and see how much damage these do. So they do 3.89p damage. That is a lot. Maybe it's not a lot for, like, other people, like, people on the leaderboards and stuff. But that's a lot for me because my my team is, like, pretty bad right now. But yeah, let's go ahead and head back over to the material world. And let's go ahead and get this brand new mount, which is this one right here, the Halloween pumpkin. And let's go ahead and check out the other stuff. So claim this, the mount, this, and this. And this brand new weapon right here. That looks awesome. And let's go ahead and check out all of this stuff. So here is the brand new mount. First of all, let's go ahead and unequip all so we can go ahead and check it out. And alright, this mount, mount is actually a lot bigger than previous ones. And it actually looks pretty cool. I might actually use this one in the regular game. Because it has like bats right here carrying the pumpkin. Yeah, this one I actually really like. It looks pretty cool. But yeah, let's go ahead and unequip that for now. And let's go ahead and check out this brand new weapon. So this one right here, special ability, always does the same amount as your best weapon. So, so it's similar to these ones right down here. But these ones, they just did like regular damage. 2.08 trillion is like the max it did. So, so they were pretty good, but they didn't have anything special. 
but this one right here it does. So, so that is awesome. Actually, kind of pretty small, but it looks crazy right now. Have like it has like bats and stuff coming off of it. All right, so if we go ahead and unequip all, and yeah, it counts as your best item if you go ahead and equip best. So, so that right there it looks really cool. Yeah, and that is pretty much this update though. Really awesome update. But yeah, that's going to go ahead and be all for this video though. So go ahead and leave a like, subscribe, and turn on post notifications. And I'll see you all in the next video.